Right, so the other day, I was watching one of my mate Jake's videos. You might know him as Trollsus, right? I'll leave his link in the description down below. But he started this series called YouTube Unseen, where he looks at loads of different weird shit on the internet, right? But he came across something, and I just can't not talk about it. So it turns out, if you search a message for my girlfriend into the YouTube search bar, you get a little bit more than just Comic Sans slideshows with a bit of Enrique Iglesias over the top. Okay, so quickly, just before we start this, when I've been editing this bag, I'm a bit worried that it comes across slightly more harshly than I've meant it. So I just want to let you know that I've got nothing against these people personally. These videos are just horrendous. I love you. A mashup for my girlfriend. Yeah, oh, well, this is proper romantic. <sighs> kitten. Hey, kitten. Hmm. It's a bit rude, isn't it? I love you. Aw, I love you too. How are you? <clears throat> Perfect, now I'm with you. Well, this is gonna be a long four minutes. And we'll start the video off with him just staring at a photo of her on his laptop. 100% normal behavior. Could have at least cleared your plate, mate. Oh, for fuck's sake. So he's whacked his camera in what I really hope is his washing machine, had a bit of a look at it through his fringe, and then shut the lid to reveal, I love you. Pretty realistic, that. Hang on, what is actually going on here? He's literally just filmed himself walking into a room with a really well aligned sign over the top of his TV and then just strutting past the camera. Why? I don't get it. <laughs> we better not be in the fridge right now. Oh, for God's sake. This has Raw XD written all over it. And now he's just kicking about his living room, all casual, right? You know, sat on the chair, having a casual drink of what I'm just going to assume is Monster Energy. Has to be, done it. Like, what actually is the point of this? Like, what's this a mashup of? Honestly, I've got no idea what's going on here. Oh, fair enough. This bit's nice. Why didn't we just make it 20 seconds of this, mate? Like, that could have been quite nice. But no, we've got a time lapse of her eating a bagel instead. Right, okay. I'm pretty sure this was mentioned in Jake's video as well. But he must have just texted her, being like, Kitten, can you uh, stand up and film yourself, like, spinning in a circle for a bit? All right, cool. They've even got matching fringes. And it doesn't even stop there. A lovely message to my girlfriend. And it's been made by Rubius Hagrid. Mate, don't throw up on my bed. Oh, I'm going to throw up. <laughs> Hi. What's with all these bloody fringes? Anyway, I just wanted to say that I'm really happy that you won your game. It's so nice to hear. Um, I love you. Well, this isn't weird. He's recording a message to his girlfriend, right? Whilst Macaulay Culkin over there is like, Oh, I've drunk loads, mate. I'm gonna throw up. Why is this on YouTube? We'll move on. And this is a message to my girlfriend. Well, it's only been a week since we met each other, or five days, or six days, or seven days. It's probably been a week now since we met each other, and you know, we're already getting along. You kind of love me already. Oh, I should have known this was coming. It's just your typical year seven relationship, this. I love how unenthusiastic he seems about all this. Yeah, well, I mean, you know, it's, it's been a week. Um, you love me. Yeah, yeah, cool. She said she loved me, and I'm like, oh, okay. Good. Oh, okay, that's good. I actually can't deal with this kid. I mean, my ex is now a bitch and stuff, and now I don't date her no more. I bloody well hope so, mate. So then this new girl likes me, and I'm like, oh, okay, so I guess I have a new girlfriend now. So now I'm dating again, you know. Life's kind of hard sometimes, you know. Poor kid. Moving on. Girlfriend, you know how much I love you, and you're, um, pretty, and, um, sometimes I... Miss you. Sometimes I miss you. Not all the time. Just sometimes. You can't get more romantic than this. Mean comments will be removed, by the way, because I'm not accepting any mean comments. Even if it, if there's a JK, I'm still gonna delete that because um I'm just like that, you know. Oh, I need to try that. From now on, if you're gonna call a squarehead, you're gonna have to do it with JK at the end of the comment. Then it's fine. A poem for my girlfriend. Well, she's a bit young. And then we'll finish off with possibly the worst of them all. Message for my sexy uni student girlfriend. Here we go. And it's been made by Jim Guy. It honestly can't get worse than this. Hey, baby. Um, just a little message for you. Hang on. Uni student? Are you sure, mate? Just to let you know how proud of you I am. I'll be at work at the moment and you'll be on your way to your exam. Right, okay, but honestly, right? Could you not have just given her a bell? Like, is there actually anything in this video that couldn't have just been said in a voicemail? In the words of Neil Patrick Harris and... Soon you will see Mr. Kim Jong-il. 
Oh, I salute you, baby. Someone come get that dad. He's blatantly divorced, right? And he's made this video just sat there being like, right, how can I make my ex-wife jealous? Oh, I know. I'll call her a sexy uni student. Oh, I'm so much fun putting that university card away and getting down and having awesome loving. Oh God, get down to awesome loving. And that's where we're gonna finish. So anyway guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you have enjoyed. As I've already said, I've got that idea off Jake's and I feel like if you like my content, you'll really like his. So make sure you go check him out in the description down below. As always, if you wanna follow me on Twitter, my ad's here, my Instagram's down below, my Snapchat's just to the side there. Anyway, if you have enjoyed, please leave a like. It genuinely means a massive amount to me. And if you're new around here, feel free to subscribe and I'll see you guys later.